Hey guys, Jen here. I am making a soap today. I am making Burst of Energy by Be Scented. Um, it smells amazing. It is a bright, fresh, uh, citrus fragrance. And it just reminds, it just wants you, you want to be happy when you smell it. So, I have decided on bright colors for this soap as well because I think it just fits it. I'm going to do Groovy Green from Bee Scented, Orange, and Canary Yellow. I have my liquid oils back here with my additives. I've got my titanium dioxide mixed up if I need it. Got my fragrance out over here mixed, uh, measured out. Lye water is being used to melt my hard oils here. And we shall be ready to get this show on the road. I made Sweetberry Licious earlier. Um, Mother's Day is coming up, so um, I'm getting soaps made for Mother's Day. And uh, I don't know about all moms liking floral stuff. I personally love fruity since so um i also i have i have other stuff down in there pink sands Ooh, i'm gonna make pink sands it's amazing gonna do some men's scents you know because after mother's day is father's day so i'm gonna do tobacco and bay leaf um what else do we have down in here to make um, i got monkey farts for kids <laughs> I've just got a variety of scents down in there that I want to get done that I've not made in a while. Um, I've not done Pink Sands in a long time. I've not done Cherry Citrus. I've not done Monkey Farts. I've not done any of those. So, we are going to. I'm going to use my stick blender to buzz up the last little bit of oils. <laughs> to mix up our additives. I'm hoping to do a drop swirl with this one. I went to do a drop swirl on my last soap, but it kind of set up a little bit too much, so I switched gears. <laughs> You know, don't have your heart set on a certain design. Be open to change is all I can say in soap making. Don't be upset if you make go to do something and it doesn't work out. People are still going to buy your soap. No matter if the design turned the way you wanted it to or not. Because, you know, your soap's still amazing. Gonna buzz this just a little. That's good. We're gonna do our colors. Then we'll stir in our fragrance. Then we'll be ready to go. I haven't decided if I'm gonna add white. I think I'm going to, but a small amount of white. Maybe one of these containers of white. have oatmeal milk and honey coming up on my website 
And I also have honeysuckle that's coming up. So they'll be up in the next uh, just a couple weeks. Oatly milk and honey may be ready this week. I'm gonna give this a little stir. Now we're gonna go with our colors. These are very neon bright colors. Little goes a long way. You can always add more, but you can't take it away. Now I'm going to put the fragrance in because these have to be stick blended. So. We'll start with white. This is a 250 ml bottle container. That's it. On that, I'm going to go to yellow. Then we'll go to orange. We'll go to green. Beautiful. I did not add a lot because I don't want these in your face, you know. Bright, you know, where you can't stand to look at the soap kind of thing. I always like to hand stir just a little. Let's get us a mold. Now, as explained in my last video, I'm going to do it the same way as in doing the drop swirl. Going to start and we're going to go get a little base of color in there. I always like to start out with just a little base of color. Then we're going to go up and down, make three lines. Try to work quickly, but be efficient. You don't want to pour big globs. You want thin lines. And you need a fragrance that works with you. That allows you to do this. The thicker your line is when you pour it, the thicker your drop swirl will be. The bigger the plops of color. So keep that in mind. Give them a little shimmy shake. Helps loosen it up or you can stir it with your spoon. Try to alternate where you hit. So you get drops everywhere. And if you want to do four lines, do four lines. You don't want to pour, if your fragrance, your soap matter is loose, you don't want to pour from really high up because then it does more than a drop. It drops down and comes back up in the soap. So you get more than just a drop swirl. This one's behaving nicely for me to do my drop swirl. Hmm. 
I missed a little bit right there, so kind of went back. And as it gets thicker, you can pour from a little bit higher. That's all of my white. The rest will be for the top. I think I only have one more of these anyways. I'm going to make this be the last. Yeah. There wasn't enough to go around again. If you notice that the it's sitting right on top when you drop it, kind of pull it up, make it drop from higher above. So it'll sink in some. Okay, that's that. The beauty of a drop swirl is we're officially done. We just have to put soap on the top. I think I'm gonna save the white for last. Just gonna drizzle it around. You can do however you want for the top. Just be sure not to plop hard so it uh, doesn't go through. You want it to stay on top. Now we'll do orange. green. This was a beauty to work with. Clean up what I've plopped on the stove top. I'm gonna give it a little tap, kind of even it out. I'm gonna take my chopstick and kind of swirl the top. I'm just making a figure eight. Which makes a beautiful design on the top. I'll bring it up closer. See how that figure eight just makes it beautiful. Okay guys, bring you back for the cutting. Hey guys, we are back to cut our Burst of Energy. Um, I was going to unmold it on camera for you guys so you guys can see how it does. I love the bee scented molds. take my time unmolding then I just roll it over now wipe up my mess I'll clean my counter here good or stove top good once I'm done cutting all my soaps but I just try to get the majority of it up all right so let me get it back here on my cutter. Turned out so good. I can't wait to see the inside. I 
hadn't made soaps in so long that I was like itching to get soaps made. Oh, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Yay! Zoom me in just a smidgen more. So you can really see the swirl good. Beautiful drop swirl. Swirls with um, the chopstick are like my favorites. I love the colors on this. So bright and cheery. are in pieces and samples. Alright guys, thank you much for watching. We'll catch you on the next video.